This six foot ten Kevin Durantville might be the most fun I've had on 2K24 so far, hitting 70% contested jump shots with no takeover. And you know we're Kevin Durant, so we gotta play a little bit of defense. Come down here to the mid range, just a little bit of a patient offense, shooting over seven footers. I mean, it doesn't get much better than that. And you know what? We can get contact dunks too. This build might be breaking the game. So we're gonna go ahead and get right into this. All I ask is for you guys to go ahead and drop a like. Also, if there's any builds that you guys have made so far that you've kind of grinded out a little bit, make sure to send me an email if you want me to use it for a video. But we're gonna go with the power forward position, six foot 10, 210 pounds. And I know a lot of you guys are gonna be saying, oh, you're six foot 11 wings, Fan T Rex arms. This is what you got to do to get a good mid range to get three point shot. Because if I go max wingspan here, this does not look like Kevin Durant with an 83 mid range and a 76 three pointer. Even if you go like 75 or 74, 87 mid range and 83 point shot to me, it's just not Kevin Durant. So we have to go with a six foot 11 wingspan. We get a good mid range, get three point shot, and trust me, you still hold your own in the paint and you can still shoot over people with ease. Now, this is how we're going to upgrade the build for the finishing. We only have a 71 close shot, 80 driving layup, 87 driving dunk, so we can get contact dunks. The standing dunk this year, it really does not matter. I don't know if you guys have played enough to where you can tell that like if you have any momentum, you're gonna get like a standing dunk animation. Even if you have a little bit of momentum going to the paint and you're like still in the paint, you're gonna get a standing dunk. I know it's kind of weird to explain, but trust me, 55 standing dunk is gonna be okay. We went with an 85 post control here so we could get post fade phenom on Hall of Fame, which you know what, it's Kevin Durant. So we have to be able to shoot over people. 85 post control is huge on this build. Good post mid technician, all that good stuff. So that's what I did. Now this is what we did for the shooting. 90 mid range, 85 three point shot. There are so many clips. I played for like maybe a few hours on the build right after I did a rebirth. The amount of tough three point shots I was making, don't even like, I didn't even have sharp takeover. A lot of them were just shooting over people. 15% contested, two people jumping at me. It didn't matter. I was just hitting three point shots with ease. So the 85 three pointer is great. The 90 mid range, I mean, like I said, we're Kevin Durant. So like 90 mid range, I was shooting consistently with like an 80 something. So like 90 mid range is pretty crazy. And having a 90 mid range, you get like gold dead eye, gold blinders. You also get Hall of Fame open looks because you have to have a 90 mid range for that. So every open shot, it just feels like it's going in. So a 90 mid range, super good. That's why I went there. So combining stuff like gold space creator, gold mini magician, guard up, dream shake, post fade, phenom, all that stuff in the mid range, your butter. Especially with that dead eye and blinders. So many contested shots go in, it's not even funny. My playmaking looks okay. We got a 73 pass accuracy, 75 ball handle, 70 speed with ball. 73 pass accuracy for the park is great. You're not gonna need much more. But the 75 ball handle was interesting because I haven't really tried that threshold yet. I tried a few animations, but the ones that I have on right now, I kind of liked. I was able to kind of do simple escapes, you know, just crossovers, simple stuff, nothing too crazy on the six foot 10 yet. I haven't really lapped as much as I would like to, but the moves that I was using, just dribbling wise, it was easy. I was getting open looks and that's all you can ask for at six foot 10. And I will show you guys some gameplay and I will show you guys my animations and the badges that I currently have. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Now you might think the defense looks a little underwhelming for a six foot 10 build, but trust me, this plays so much better than what the stats are showing. 61 interior, 72 perimeter, 73 steel. So we do get glove interceptor and right stick ripper on bronze, which is pretty solid, you know, even for Kevin Durant. We got 77 blocks, so we got bronze anchor, we got bronze rebound chaser, we got silver box out beast, you know, silver pogo stick. So you know what, I, this build isn't supposed to be a defensive juggernaut, but it holds its own, trust me. I haven't really, so far, I know I'm just playing park, but I haven't really faced any huge deals defensively yet. And physical, 75 speed, 70 acceleration, we do get bronze bulldozer, which is actually pretty fun. I've got it to pop up, which was kind of surprising. I just threw it on, you know, I was like, hey, let me go attack the basket and see if I could get any bulldozer clips, and I got a few of them. So I was kind of surprised, kind of nice just to have a little bailout like that. And of course, the 99 stamina, which is great. You can see the shades of Al Harrington. Of course, we got our guy Kevin Durant and Paolo Bancaro, and we have a three level threat. So this is currently my build at a 91 overall. This is how I went about upgrading it. Of course, we had to go with the driving dunk a little bit of the post control for the post fade phenom. 90 mid range, 85, three point shot. Like I said, defensively, this is how I upgraded it. And this is how I did all my physicals. And to be honest with you, 
this is great if you have like a 90 overall if you have the rebirth this is how i would kind of go about upgrading it and these are currently the badges that i have right now this is just from playing park for like a day or two so you can see we already have like the open looks on hall of fame dream shake on gold we have a lot of good badges and we also have hall of fame big driver so apparently this helps you off the dribble in the mid range and like i said when you're kevin durant you kind of need that so that's been kind of nice so far of course we got the interceptor badge all that good stuff tons of gold badges like i said catch and shoot corner specialist blinders limitless range all that stuff already on gold so you know we're looking pretty op and you know what i'm a nice guy i'm gonna show you all the animations that i'm rocking with currently right now these are all the dribble animations nothing too crazy we have a few kevin durant stuff on right now i've been liking the step back zach levine which you need a 75 uh speed with ball actually 75 ball handle for so i've been liking that one i tried out a few of them but zach levine seems to be really good ladies and gentlemen this jump shot right here has has been butter for me kevin durant base the marcus alders release one and marquis chris release two just throw this on i don't know what it is kevin durant's base this year is really good i think it's the new pro play but this jump shot right here has been money now as always i wanted to show you guys some gameplay this first one is probably the quickest game i've ever played we're going up against a seven foot three post score we do get ball first you guys can see the post control of that so i was like you know what we're just not going to turn the ball over so we don't have to deal with guarding this guy you can see first play a little hop jumper green it's cash it's so easy man i'm telling you there's gonna be no cussing this i'm just gonna fast forward some stuff but this is how quick the game really was look at me a little little dribble combo like i said the 7-3 post score has no chance of guarding me i mean i don't really have a chance of guarding him either so i was just like you know what we're just gonna make sure we don't miss if we don't miss we're good and i'm gonna show you guys how consistent all these jump shot and badges and all this you just got to pay attention to the top right watch everything that pops up i mean it's just really easy you see he doesn't want to come out here and guard me and i noticed that from the get go but we're going to drive straight to the left little dribble pull up like we're kevin durant knock that down i cannot wait till they add some of his animations in the game like the dribble pull up the post fade all that it's gonna be really nice to actually look like kevin durant but look at this right here i noticed he's just sitting in the paint my good sir you can't do that that's kd baby we're shooting from limitless range i know we got sharp takeover but again like i said very consistent the open looks on hall of fame is probably the, my favorite badge and i only needed to get a 90 mid range for that like i said he can't keep up with me we're knocking down another three like this gameplay is just flowing super easy they thought i was gonna be sweet posting with a seven foot three post score down here in the paint it's just it's just not gonna work out because we're not gonna turn the ball over you can see again spotting up from the hash catch and shoot knockdown hey i mean do i need to say anymore how how easy this is how well this build shoots with an 85 three-pointer i know it's an 85 but boys this shoots so well and the kevin durant jump shot this year it's just chicken so they try to switch the guard onto me you see do a little snatch back crossover mid-range money knocking it down now blinders i do believe popped up right there blinders and i think dead eye like i said through all this gameplay all these gameplays just make sure you pay attention to the top right just see all the bad combinations come up but you see again trying to dribble a little bit you know what i said you, let's try a little off dribble three bang knock that down post score not touching the ball i think we went eight for eight just real simple now this next game i guess you could say was a little bit more competitive it's kind of interesting you see they had a six foot nine and this guy was a lockdown defender with a high strength high steel all that kind of stuff like that so we had to play a little bit differently but just remember the guy that i'm guarding is six foot eleven so you can see right here we're trying to combo up a little bit i get by him easily but he gets a nice chase down block so this was the first challenge we had to go up against because these guys both defensively at least like stopping getting blocks and stuff like that were pretty decent they contested some good shots as well but you can see right here i try to do the little slip pop it doesn't work but we're kevin durant all we need is a little bit of room 11 percent contested really is like wide open for this build i'm not gonna lie to you so you can see like i said beforehand all of our little back doors they weren't really working even like right here i tried to do another back door and just get bumped out of bounds like i said these guys had some strength they had some good you know defense on them but this was the thing that i was talking about kind of a weird offense you can see we're playing some defense too but this was like a six foot 11 guy just trying to fade mid ranges and this lockdown was like setting screens so it's kind of weird you can see again i get bumped out of bounds but i wanted to show you guys some defense too look we could poke the ball loose a little bit see we have enough defense so we can do that we're going back down here again playing more defense which is nice kick it out to weaves even though he misses it i just want to showcase some defense for you guys you can see right here again we play really good defense so i'm not really worried that's why i can kind of have the confidence at least in the park to shoot shots like this because i know we're gonna get stops regardless you can see again a little hop jumper backwards man I, this build has been so much fun for me though just being able to shoot like mid ranges and stuff like this the mid range game this year is just so good like last year it was pretty good but this year the stuff that goes in like spin shots and dribble pull-ups and all that kind of stuff like that are just very consistent so it's been a lot of fun but now we got that sharp shooting takeover 
finally we get a little back door to work probably shouldn't have worked we end up turning the ball over again i think maybe i stepped out of bounds or maybe weebs missed the shot it's, i don't know something like that but you can see this guy's trying to play a little bit of bully ball with me it doesn't work we force him to pick up the ball run back up to the three get a weird catch but it doesn't matter because it's cash we got sharp take we're not missing again i try to dribble up i go for the hop jumper he reaches at a perfect time like i said they got some pretty good defense but this is what made me mad they went on a little bit of a run right here i thought i played some good defense but obviously not good enough but you can see they like l2 for this guy and like set screens for him to like catch the ball and like fade so it was kind of weird they set another screen i get caught up in it and they come and cut it down to three which was kind of bad but you can see again more defense from your boy right stick ripper poking the ball loose and you know we're not missing a shot like that but after this point you know what it was smooth sailing this is kevin Durant. i gotta remember who i am and if you guys don't remember and look at the top right this is literally day one of making the builds like straight from Reaper. so you can see a lot of these badges i have on gold and the first gameplay like i had on hall of fame so we're still hitting dribble pull-ups just need a little bit of room on this build and we can hit it very easily 18 to 10. you can see the only shot we missed was that layup that we greened at the beginning so we're being pretty consistent with this build when we start to lock in it's easy blinders baby you're to the side you're not contesting it i love how that's wide open and finally it's open now and not just con somewhat contested or you get a weird jump shot pull up you know your jump shot timing gets open it's looking nice but this play right here is just the icing on the cake there's no better way you can end a kevin durant gameplay fade away over those i don't know if you guys saw the contest but it was 49 percent contested for the game hopefully you guys enjoyed if you end up making the build let me know how you enjoyed down below in the comment section until next time it's been your boy dignified i'm out peace